Hey guys, my name is James. And I'm Ashley. And we just sold our house and we are traveling across the country with our two kids. Hi, my name is Goose and this is Maverick and Apollo. Come join us. Right, guys, we are packing up and getting ready to head out of We're El Paso. Ah! <laughs> what was that? So we, uh, I don't think we've told you, but what we're doing is we are flying home for Christmas. For those of you that have been here for a while and have watched all the videos, you know our original plan was to hang out in the Pacific Northwest until after New Year's. The reality of living in an RV set in, and me in and Ash Pacific just Northwest. yeah, living the reality of living in an RV in the rain and cold, and it was getting down below freezing, just set in, and we're like, we're out of here. So we headed south, and for we have, and we have actually been traveling. We've been in the RV for two months now, but according to YouTube time, it's only been about a month. So uh, a little while ago, we put out a video telling you that we were like skipping forward in time. So if you're confused about that, you can check that out right there. But basically what's going on is we are packing up because we are flying home. So this is what our RV currently looks like right now. We have, we just did laundry. We, did laundry we just like did two weeks worth. Yeah. So. So we got clean. These are actually clean clothes over here. We're packing up stuff. Uh, we're prepping for snow. Hopefully there's some snow there because Goose has really been wanting snow. She correlates snow with Christmas like directly. If there's not snow, it is not yet Christmas. So fingers crossed, whether it be at Pops or at Papa Al's house, we hit some snow because that would be awesome. But then we also got our stroller. We got a suitcase for our clothes. Got to pack diapers and stuff for this one right here. Yeah. Oh, we're so happy now. The cheap side of us, Ashley's getting super excited. So the cheap side in us uh, made us decide to actually fly out of Phoenix. And that is a six to seven hour drive from El Paso. The reason we're doing that is because we saved about half on tickets. So instead of spending like 1500 bucks on tickets for all of us to fly home, it was closer to around 800, which is still a lot of money. It still hurts, but it was way more affordable. So tomorrow morning, we're getting up early. We're driving all the way to Phoenix, Arizona, which is where I went riding with Clintus, by the way. Uh, and then we're flying home. <laughs> Mommy is getting super excited. So basically everybody gets four outfits because I'm like, we're gonna be at people's houses. We will do laundry. And I have been forewarned that the girls are getting clothes. So I don't want to overpack plus if we can fit all of our stuff in this little one, Boom. and then that. this one can stay semi-open for anything that we have to bring back. So anytime somebody's like, what do you want for Christmas? Yeah. We're like, gift cards and things that are small because we have poor, to- Poor Maverick, everybody asks and I'm like, she wants puffs and food squeezies and yogurt belts and mum mums. And whenever it's like, what does Goose want? I'm like, she would like a diesel gift card. I no, I tell them gift cards because she's at the point where she's really excited to use her own monies. Yeah. And it's really cute because when we were out to dinner the other day, she goes, mom, can I use my unicorn credit card? Can I use my unicorn credit card to pay for this? I, and then she goes, I gotcha. <laughs> I, that's new to me. All right, so we're gonna keep packing up here and we'll probably cut to tomorrow morning when we're driving when to Phoenix. We're going high. Ooh, all right, you guys, we have made it to Phoenix, Arizona airport and we are actually completely through security. Oh my goodness, you guys. Let me tell you, you know airport security is ridiculous, but apparently Phoenix airport is running this pilot program, which so it's like a new program that they're rolling out and you have to take out all food. We're traveling with two children and this woman was 
prepared to say the least. We had basically an entire backpack full of snacks and things that we had to take out, not to mention my laptop, phones, belts, anything in your pockets, shoes, like it. This, oh yeah, you have to take off jackets too. I've never had to take off a sweatshirt before. What? I am so thankful that we got here early and it was the non-peak rush hour because there was pretty much no one in line. If it was busy rush hour time, I can't imagine how many hours it would have taken. We, yeah, we would have been those people that people were pissed at. We were already, we already, we already were holding up the line. But we're here and we are crazy early. Like I said, we have, what is it? It is, we have three hours, until, over three hours until our flight takes off. So we're gonna get some food, relax, probably watch a show, and then fly home to Portland. What did you say? What did you tell so him sweet. though? Thank you very much. Merry <laughs> Christmas to you too. Would you want to get a picture of the seat? Sure. All right. Oh, you want to sit in the seat, kiddo? Can you squeeze right on through there and then hop in my seat, okay? Mm -hmm. Then we'll get some pictures of you in there. There you go. Good job. <laughs> All right. So Yo, now what I want you to do. We're feeling, feeling, feeling safe. Seeing your flight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think yeah. that's teaching you how to fly. Yes. There you go. <laughs> can you get a picture of that? Look at that. Oh, you taking off? Don't actually push any buttons. <laughs> All Very right. cool. Thank right. you so much. snowed <laughs> stay away from the road your feet are gonna be freezing we are driving over the top of Mount Hood and we just had to stop we're not gonna like go sledding or anything but we had to stop to let goose play in the snow are you walking in the deep snow your feet are gonna be freezing oh don't fall <laughs> Ooh, is that cold <laughs> Should we throw a snowball at mom? Ready? Okay. Ready? Set. Go. <laughs> it is so cold out here right now, and I have no gloves. Are your feet freezing? Oh no, that's cold. That's cold! <laughs> no way! I absolutely love the look of fresh snow-covered pine trees. It's probably one of the most beautiful things in my mind and one of the things that reminds me of Christmas the most is snow-covered pine trees. Driving through this pass is so beautiful. I absolutely love it. All right, let's get back in the car before we get frostbite.
All right, guys, we're almost at Pops' house, and he said he did some special Christmas decorating just for Goose. You excited? It's been, what, a month or two months since you've seen Pops and Grammy? How long has it been since we've seen them? It's been a little over a month. It's been about a month. month. A little over a month. Which to some people might not seem like that long, but she's used to seeing her Grammy and Pops, I would say, at least twice a month. So for her to go a month and a half without seeing them, it's pretty impressive. Okay. okay, close your eyes and we'll tell you when we get close. What's around the tree? Rudolph. Oh, Rudolph geez. and two other reindeer. Rudolph. So cool. Look at all these lights, Goose. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Oh, and did he replace his lights with LEDs? I think he replaced all of his icicle lights with LED lights. What is it? You can start get, get her started like a little rip and then let her pull it open. Let her start opening. All right, pull it. Yeah. Well, I mean, my sister's trying to get me in trouble by turning. Can you open? Pull. Do you remember Goose's first present? Yeah. How confused she was too to try to open the paper. But she was also three months. She would say. But you learned Thank quickly. You for the tissue paper. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, is that what I think it is? Oh You're my goodness. Oh, oh my that'll goodness. be you soon. I bet you she could actually use that this week. Oh no, she could. Okay. What are you doing? Oh really? I don't think I don't think so. Okay. What are you doing, Goose? Making cookies. Why are you For making cookies? Ooh, Santa. What did you get from Santa Claus this morning? What did Dee Dee the elf on the shelf bring you? Um, a letter. And what did the letter from Santa say? He's coming this tonight. 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 Santa is coming three know. days early to our house here because he knows we're going to be traveling around a lot. So we have to get cookies ready tonight. That way we can put them out. So Santa, when he delivers the gifts the tonight, did we get that There's he will have a treat to read. Yes. Yes. <laughs> so that way he will have a treat that he has, when he has energy to get back home and go to all see the boys and girls tonight. So anyways, we are getting the cookies and what else are we gonna give them? Milk? Carrots. Carrots? Carrots for the reindeer. Oh, very cool. Milk. I bet he doesn't get chocolate milk very often. I Probably not. Either. We have eggnog. So the girls, so the girls are making cookies right now, and Goose is very excited. How about you, Maverick? You excited? Okay. Are you excited that Santa's coming early? He's coming. Santa. He's coming. Santa. Treat again. The tree. Okay. Yeah. Tell mom we're probably gonna need some more. Mom, we're probably going to need some more powder. Okay. Okay. Those are unique little cutters. I've never seen those before with a spring-loaded ejector. Yeah. All right, so what do we got here? How many carrots did we decide we needed? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There's nine reindeer, right? Including Rudolph? Is it so? So let's okay. So we need nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we can take away two. There you go. You can eat those. I just pressed my teeth. Okay, then we can just throw them away. All right. So we got. Sure. Okay. We got three cookies for Santa, and nine uh, carrots. One for each reindeer. So we are set. All right, let me know guys down below. Did you leave out any treats for Santa? And if you did, what kind of treats did you leave? Chocolate chip cookies, sugar cookies, sugar cookies with any frosting. Kind you think he would like, oh, he would probably doing? eat. Nope. Oreos, and did you leave chocolate milk? What Almond milk? What kind, of, what kind of treats did you leave for Santa? Comment Santa. down below. All right, are you ready for bed, girls? <laughs> Santa's coming tonight, so we better get stay asleep. coming tonight. To town. All right, let's go get ready for bed. He's making a list. He's checking it twice. Gonna find out who's naughty or nice. Santa Claus is coming to town. <laughs> who's excited to open Christmas presents? Oh, goodness! 
Are you excited? Did you check to see what? if Santa even came yet? She hasn't even looked yet. You she haven't even looked? Well, let's go see if the cookies and the carrots and everything are gone. Let's go look. Santa doesn't eat carrots. Those were for the reindeer. Of course he's not healthy. Maybe that's why one of the reindeer came up. Hey. Oh. Half. Oh my goodness. Well, you, how many cookies either. did you give him? I gave him like... Four. Yeah, so that's a lot of cookies. So we ate two and a half cookies and the reindeer ate their carrots. Maybe that's why. Tell dad what happened when you got up this morning and came into Granny and Pops' room. We saw some um, reindeer prints. What? It's. <gasps> what? So close. Oh my goodness. Uh, that is so cool. What's in there? A polar bear. That's awesome. You know what? That would make a great new night light. Don't you think? That's wow. awesome. Thank you, Santa. I know. He that's so cool. Cause that's isn't that what you asked Santa for when we went and saw him the other day? Uh, a unicorn? <gasps> it's rarity. What? what? Rarity. All right, Maverick. What did you get from Santa? from Santa? Your first present from Santa? Was rip, this? pull, go, rip. She says every time I do this to everything else, you say no. <laughs> uh, what is it? Oh. <gasps> That's what I had. It's, it's Elmo. Just what you wanted. So cool. Oh, so yeah. See if there's so any... What what all did you ask Santa for and what did you get? Snow globe and unicorn. I got a pulver snow globe and a and rarity. And I asked for a Rudolph toy. So the only thing Santa hasn't bought you is a Rudolph toy? You got everything else you asked for? That's pretty good. Two out of three toys from Santa? That's oh, that's, that's pretty bad, good. Huh? What do you say to Santa? Thank you. <laughs> and then mommy and daddy may have brought our presents up. For Would you like to open like some to open more them? presents this morning? Sure. Okay, those red ones right there, you can slide them out and mommy will tell you who they're for. found her favorite toy boxes snow we are all first off i'll show you our outfit pull up your pants let's see the shoes we got some frozen shoes that we've had for like two years they're finally fitting brand new uh snow pants slash jumpsuit gloves snow jacket hat and ears Can you unlock it, please? yep let's go snow day oh, what it's beginning to look a lot like <laughs> Nothing makes it feel more like Christmas than the first snow. I eat this part. Sure. I am so stoked that the morning we do Christmas, bam, first snow, and it just makes everything look so gorgeous. To be honest, I hope I wish there was like an inch or two more because it whoa, then we could do better sledding. But it's plenty cold. It's stuck around for the afternoon, and we're gonna go have some fun. Uh, they're probably in their stalls, I would guess, because it's the warmest spot. They are, oh my goodness, what weirdos. Don't you guys know it's freezing out here, literally? Whoa. That is a muddy stall you guys got. Yeah, they messed it up. They've been walking in it, so they've been making it not quite so pretty in there. 
You do have your winter coats on. You're looking nice and fuzzy. All right, so unfortunately, there's not quite enough snow to actually go down the hills by yourself, but this kid is obsessed with eating snow. How's it taste? Yeah. Snow sled, take one. <laughs> <laughs> You're weird. Oh, <laughs> oh, look at me. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. Ho, 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 Why is it that doing all of these activities with her? I'm always the one getting a massive workout and she's having a blast. <sighs> I need a giant to pull me around on a sled. Gonna <laughs> 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 get, get ya. Snow is too dry here to make a good snowball. So it's just kind of like throwing snow powder at people. Ah! <laughs> oh, you th oh, you threw dirt at me. <laughs> no throwing dirt, you get snow. Come here. <laughs> Where is she? Come <laughs> Oh, in the face. <laughs> Uh. Come and behold him, born the king of angels. Come, let us adore him. Come, let us adore him. Come, let us adore him. Christ the Lord. We are making butter bonbons because I used to make those with my mom when I was little and I remember with Grammy yep yeah. and I remember loving making them and they were really easy and they were delicious and it was just something fun for us to do for right now well, oh, 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 oh. so that is what we're going to do are you wanting are you wanting to make some bonbons you want some bonbons? I want to eat them. So we opened presents. We got to find out we're going to Disneyland. We went sledding. We got a Starbucks treat. We're making cookies. Was today a pretty good day? Yeah. How good? On a scale of one to 10? 99.33. 99.33 99, on a scale of one to 10? That's pretty good, I guess. I think this has been a perfect Christmas day. It was relaxing, it was low key, it snowed. She got excited with her presents. Honestly, there was, isn't much we more. breakfast. Oh yeah, they, she, I don't think I filmed that. They made a delicious breakfast this morning with sausage and bacon and eggs and hash browns, hash browns all sorts of good stuff. So, awesome Christmas. Let me know down below, what did you guys do for Christmas, Christmas Eve? Comment down below and let me know what you guys did and if you got anything cool like a snow globe for Christmas.